In this video, I'm going to show you guys something very, very cool. I'm going to show you guys exactly how I trade on Bybit. Bybit is the trading platform that I've used to make trades like this, this, and this. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys how Bybit works and how you can get signed up as well. So make sure to sit down, relax, and let's get into this video. Now in this video, I'm going to show you guys very quickly without any nonsense added to it, how to trade on Bybit. This is going to be a very quick video, but it is going to explain you exactly how I trade on Bybit and how as well you can get started. Now, first of all, you got to create an account. It is very, very simple. Click the first link in the description or click the first link in the comment section and it will bring you to this page and you can sign up using your email or your mobile phone. So choose which one you prefer and then click over here, sign up. After doing that, it will bring you to this homepage and then you've got to deposit funds. So click on the top right on your name, on your email address or your phone number and then click on my assets. This will bring you to the asset page and this is where you can deposit your funds. For instance, if you want to deposit Bitcoin, click right over here on the right side on deposit and then it will show you a Bitcoin address where you can send your funds. And if you want to withdraw, click on the right side and then it will show you the process on how to withdraw your funds back to your wallet. Now, once you have deposited your funds, Go to trade on the left top side and then click on inverse. That's the one that I'm using. And so this is the one that I'm going to be using for this tutorial. Now you're seeing a lot of different things right over here. The first big large screen. This is the price of the asset that you're trading. Then in the middle, you can see the order book under the order book. These are the recent trades. And when you place a trade, you can see here on the bottom, when you enter this trade, how much this trade is for instance in profits or in losses. Now, if you want to build a trade, you've got to go all the way to the top right. And here's where you can enter a trading position. Now, let me explain you what leverage trading is very simply. So you can go either into a long or into a short position. If you go into a long position, you expect the price to go to the upside. If you go into a short position, you expect the price to move to the downside. Now, let's say we expect the price to go from around 18,000 US dollars to 19,000 US dollars. This would be an increase of about 5%. Now, let's say we enter with about 10,000 and we use 10x leverage. What you can see is something very interesting. So the price moved up 5% and because we went into a long position, we are going to be profiting from this move. This gave us approximately 52% profit. So very simple example here. If the price moves up about 5% and you use 10x leverage, you can make 50% profits. But if the price goes the other way and it instead goes to 17,000 US dollars, then you would have made about 60% losses. So you can see that there's a lot of returns potential, but also a lot of risks. So it's very important that you do your own research when trading and that you do not use leverage training when you are inexperienced. Now, right over here on the right side, this is where you can build your position. So let's say for instance, we want to enter a trade on about 18,000 US dollars and we want to use about 10% of our portfolio. You can click right over here on the right. Then we want to use 10X leverage. It is very important that you click here on isolated and you bring this all the way back to 10x and then you can see we're using 10x leverage now if you're wondering what's the difference between limit market and conditional well very simply i only use limit and market i don't think conditional is very important but limit means you place an order in the order book and market means that you can take from the order book so i would say only if you are in a hurry use the market option over here but if you're not in a hurry just use the limit order. This is as well cheaper because you will be paying less fees. So let's go through everything that you're seeing right now on the screen. So I want to place a limit order. So I want to place an order in the order book and I want to be using 10X leverage for this trade. Now I want to go into a long position when the price goes to about 18,000 US dollars. I use 10% of my balance that I have on Bybit. And right now I can place my order. Now, very important to keep in mind that you select over here post only. And if you want to place a stop loss or a take profit, then you can click right over here and you can put a take profit. So for instance, I want to exit on 19,000 US dollars. It will show you over here. That will be about a 50% profit and I would get about 0.7 BTC. And as well, I can post a stop loss. So let's say I want to lose maximum 25% on this trade. You can see that if the price goes to 17,561 US dollars, my trade will be exited on a loss of about 0.35 BTC. So right now I can place the trade and then on the chart, you will see exactly where my order is. Now I don't want to actually enter this trade, so I'm gonna cancel it over here. But if I actually enter a trade, then you will show it over here on the bottom. I could, for instance, enter here with a market trade just with one contract. Yeah, you can see over here on the bottom, this is where I entered my trade. And then I used over here one contract. So this is only an example trade. And I entered over here on the current price. My liquidation price is on 16,500 US dollars. So this is where I will be 100% stopped out because after that, I will have no longer margin to keep my position funded. You can see the losses and the profits right over here. And then if I want to enter a stop loss or a take profit, I can still do it right over here where I can enter stop loss or take profit. Now keep in mind, I do not recommend anyone to get into leverage trading. This video is only for educational purposes only. Now, if you do want to sign up, check out my link in the description or check out the link in my comment section. And yeah, this was the end of the video. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye bye.